Hey folks, I just finished packing away our early spring china in our dining room. Now I am redoing the shelves with our collection of blue and white. Right here at my take on Home and Garden. So let's look at what we are going to use in our dining room today. Some of you, this you will recognize from our blue and white collection video we did last week. We've got the Wedgwood from England, the Bavarian Seltman Feedman in the blue onion pattern, a wonderful reticulated plate, and then we have the beautiful Blue Willow by Johnson Brothers and Churchill of England. Now this face I like to put on the side of the painted hutch because I can make a little arrangement in it. Now you can see after taking everything down I have moved our cruet collection to the top two shelves and now on to the fourth down we have some Royal Albert teacups in the yellow roses and a hand-painted vintage platter. So we're going to use a bit of our yellow for summer now these lighter blue and white vases I want to put on the buffet with these English lighter blue plates. And I have our collection of reticulated plates for the summer. But I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to use them here with the blue and white or not. We'll see. We also have figurines in the blue and white to use and we have pictures and we have got oh a handful of teapots now there is a cute teapot I was going to show you in a haul but I think I wanna use it today really nice teapot so let's get decorating and I think I am going to start out with this plate rack I think I wanna put the Wedgwood blue onion on this rack and I'm facing the pattern the same way I think that's more proper and coordinated in my opinion okay we'll have to do a little arrangement in there eventually let's get to the shelves okay guys let's work on this one side first we've got our yellow shelf we want to get some blue in here and we're going to be dominantly blue. We'll use clear plate stands till we don't have any more. <laughs> Here's that new teapot from Pier 1 made in China. Maybe a biscuit jar over here. I see that could look better with the tall piece maybe. That'll be too tall, but we'll, we can go down in here. Let's bring a ginger jar in. Start getting some balance. This is taller. That's more what I'm thinking. I want a balance of the blue willow. So in other words, I want it on both sides. We'll get a cup and saucer going on a stand. You know, you can pick those stands up. They're real reasonable. Loving that. How about this side? Could we go with the cream and sugar? And then maybe I see a bowl. Now, I don't have another slender platter like that last one, but I have this in the yellow again. Roses, so I think I'm going to go with it. And we don't have to be matchy-matchy. Just as long as weight and color balance happens here. I'll be happy with that. Let's try some decorative... Oh, I just love this teapot. Blue and white on each side of that. 
yellow is just our accent so we're not gonna be too concerned about covering that be really cool if I had a tea light there right and turned it on possibly like this now back to our blue willow is that too big one more here and get the big bowl in okay and like I mentioned my thought for the buffet would be to use these lighter pieces together the two English plates in the back give it a slight turn Something's different when I don't have the same amount of room. <laughs> okay, that cannot be in the center. Okay, now we're happy. <laughs> Probably the taller vase here, the lower here. Still have room from to my eye. And the little French piece is lighter. That's cute, I think, and that certainly leaves openings for some floral arrangements. Possibly. Hmm. Now would anybody think that I just needed those faces there <laughs> temporarily? so I could do an arrangement in them. <laughs> Thank you. Six, half a dozen roses. Rose buds. Now I can put these where they really go. And that will enhance our blue and white with yellow roses idea. Now I'm going to work out the rest of these shelves and then I'm going to take you and show you all around. Now I'm thinking maybe stagger the blue onion with the blue willow. So, every other salad plate on these side racks, I'm thinking is looking pretty good. Now, it's time to take you and show you all around. This is the little bit that we didn't use today. Starting with our four plate rack. Make sure everybody knows where we are. And the blue onion dinner plates by Wedgwood. We've got swans retiring up on top of the hutch for now. Poppies in the corner. And in our decor, this year, blue and white, chinoiserie, and others with yellow roses.
Looks like we got some empty floor vases, people. We're going to have to do something about that as well. That's another video. We're enjoying blue and white. I just find it fun to do different little arrangements on each shelf and every year I make sure they're different. Everybody that's been with us, you know that. Now after a final tweak on the buffet, I'm really happy with how this come out. Then our next set of shelves we got a surprise over here. Catch that bottom shelf first. And then I can talk about our wonderful friend, Doy from Tennessee. Some of you might recall when she sent this beautiful Bavarian berry bowl set in the luster wear in a light, light lemony yellow and I thought it would go wonderful here for this late spring with our blue and white. And it sure does. And this shelf Portugal meets England meets China. <laughs> A wonderful blue willow by Churchill. And we got a little nappy here, a little server with lemons. Then to stretch our tea sets out a little longer, we could keep the yellow yellow poppies on the teapot just out of our deco Bavarian fruit bowl and assorted yellow rose cup and saucers And again, Austria meets England, meets China, meets Austria. And some of our 85 vinegar cruet collection, not one is the same. And our mixed dessert plates, blue willow and Bavarian blue onion, right here on both sides.
hard to beat, guys. We'll have to live with it for this year. <laughs> Till the next season. Adios, amigos. Au revoir, Sherry. Und auf Wiedersehen, mein Schatz. Bon amigo. And take care, my friends. We'll see you in the next awesome video. Now folks, hopefully you enjoyed our decorate with blue and white with accents of yellow for summer, early summer with me. Thanks for coming by, take care, be good, and tell your friends how much fun we have right here on my take on Home and Garden. See you soon, we're still decorating there's seven pieces I didn't get to use in this room. Hmm. Must mean we're doing more. <laughs> we'll see you then, guys, in the next over-the-top amazing, incredible decorator and collector video.